Hello? I showed you my dick, answer me. <laughs>Got it. I thought I died. <laughs> We're good. We landed on a burger. Look at that burg, dude. Look at that fucking burg, burg dude. <laughs> what are three things you look for in a partner? Do they have eyes, ears, and at least one strand of hair? <laughs> You're not wrong. I'm not. I ain't wrong at all. Because the truth, truth hurts. The truth makes me hard. Sure. I get off to justice, truth, in the American <laughs> way. Are you bad girl? You figured out my secret, Tony. <laughs> figured out your secret. That's not how physics works. Oh, this one's fucking weird. Isn't there like a pile of shit somewhere in this level? Yeah! I, I, at least I think so. I don't know why that part stands out so well to me. Did we find out who Batgirl is yet? No, I'm, I'm waiting. I'm just holding on hope. If you want Batgirl on Matomo, who are you? Show yourself. We've got to figure it out. Like... If you're watching this and listening and also have that girl on your Itobo friends list, please spend awareness. If you're one of the 20 people. This is the Batgirl search 2016. Yes. Fucking... I fell into shit. Oh, I missed I miss the shit. There's just trucks full of shit everywhere. Because that's, that's what Texas. it's like in Texas. Texas is full of shit. This is one big shit dumpster. Yeah. Remember the Alamo? I don't. I'm 20. The Alamo happened in like 1962, dude. Yeah, it did. Yeah, it did. This is 62, dude. It's the year of Elvis. 62. <laughs> I remember 62. <laughs> Just as good as 38. <laughs> I'm gonna shit myself. <laughs> what the fuck? Remember in 32 when the Great Depression <laughs> ended? Me too. Did I tell you about the time that I when was. the Great uh, Depression ended? <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> I, was, I was at work <laughs> and I forgot that I had, like, brother, could you spare a dime on my fucking iPod? And I was listening to it, snapping my fingers, and I why looked at my co Why do you have an iPod? Also, I don't know. Why do you have an iPod? <laughs> this was like back in the day. Oh, okay. This was like back when I was a summer worker. And I looked at one of my co-workers, and I was like, man, this is some great depression music. <laughs> and he looked at what I was listening to, and he started laughing so hard. He was like, I thought you were listening to, like, Linkin Park. <laughs> He's like, who the fuck? <laughs> He's like, who listens to shit from the Great Depression? <laughs> Hello there, the angel from my nightmare. Could you spare a dime? <laughs> Don't waste your dime on me. Unless you've got a dime to spare. <laughs> I need one. <laughs> I need one. I think it's next time, that's time for episode. Next time for episode? <laughs> it's the next time for the episode. I think. I don't know. What's 15 times 3? Um, not yet. We still have 5 minutes. Okay. What's 15 times Look at all this shit! Hey Cortana. What's 15 <laughs> times 3? Oh, 45? Thanks. Nice. Nice. Nice joke, dude. Nice meme, dude. Nice joke, dude. Well, fuck this guy. Why are we still on this fucking level, Carl? What the fuck's going on? I don't know. I want to get out of here, dude. Don't make me turn on the fucking echo filter. I'll fucking do it. I'll ruin this let's play. Tony. I'll fucking ruin this recording will be done. Tony. What? It'll be fine if you do fucking feel it in the air tonight. Some nice Phil Collins.
And I remember I remember the worry, worry How could I forget it's the first time The last time we ever met But I know the reason why I'm really excited <laughs> Holy shit. Hey, Tony. Yeah. Uh, do you want to know something that might make you a little feel a little better? <coughs> Are we fucking done? Uh, do next time on Spongebob. Do we find out who Batgirl is yet? Next time on Spongebob, uh, maybe we'll actually find out who Batgirl is. Okay, right, that's a promise. I will, I, will, I will tune in to the next episode to find out who it is. Because I am also curious. As a viewer, I am very curious. Welcome back to Spongebob. We don't know who Batgirl is. <laughs> Have fun with that edit, Carl. <laughs> the hardest of fucking cuts. Do you know what I like, Tony? What? The fucking weed, dude. Yeah, that we <laughs> Big nation. <laughs> what do you hate doing now? This or watching Digimon? Um, I don't know, man. At least with this, I'm doing something. With Digimon, I was just sitting there, just like, man. I hate all of these fish jokes. That's a weird problem to have. I hate all these fish jokes. Fucking all right, dude. Fish jokes are the bane of my existence. Mm, okay. Because everyone fucking makes them. Gotcha. It's like anyone who makes a fish joke, I just want to tell them to take a pike. <laughs> See, everyone's fucking favoriting that Batgirl tweet, but y'all need to retweet it so we can figure this shit out together. Yeah. We need this mystery fucking solved, dude. We need to be the fucking mystery ink in this shit. We need to know. The people are demanding answers. Mr. Trump. What are you gonna do about this Batgirl dilemma? I'm gonna, I'm gonna fuck, fuck it. it. <laughs> What's your favorite line from a song's lyrics? I just got the answer. Hello there. The angel from, angel from my nightmare. nightmare. I'm, I'm not singing on Let's Play. I want to watch this. I need to be able to listen to it without fucking wanting to shoot myself. The I'll sing for you. The unsuspecting victim. Here, I'll, I'll be the... Darkness in the valley, we can live like Jack and Sally. If you want, you can always find me. We'll have Halloween on Christmas, and in the night, you'll wish this never ends. You'll wish this never <laughs> ends. Where are you? <laughs> and I'm so sorry. And I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I'm so pretty all the time. Fuck off the age of my dick. <laughs> if you don't like the Dreamcast, then fuck off the edge of my dick. This episode brought to you by the two best friends. This episode brought to you by Patrick Boyvin's incredibly tiny baby legs. Oh, I know what my favorite song there should be. What? Well, I have blessed the rains down in Africa. Nice. Because I'm an asshole. You're a fucking hipster douchebag. It's gonna take a lot to take me away from you. There's, There's nothing, nothing that a hundred men or more could ever do. Uh, 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 I miss I the rains, rains, the rains down, down in Africa. Africa. On the next episode of SpongeBob. Are you ready for Patrick's fucking dream, dude? I think I remember it, but I'm not sure. You ready for Patrick's fucking dream, dude? This is the most hardcore one. I, I don't. I can't remember it. Okay. Very well, sir. Challenge accepted. Very well. Your challenge is to find the golden spatula. You're holding it. You did it. 
Wasn't that the most difficult that thing? That speaks volumes of Patrick in general. Yeah. Like, wow. Fucking Patrick before the movie was fucking great. Can we get out of the area? Okay. Hey, hey, Tony, it's time to wake up. Hmm? It's time to wake up, Tony. It's actually time for me to go to bed. You've been, uh, you've, you've been asleep for, like, five years, dude. It's me. It's your friend, dude. You gotta wake up. <laughs> Tony, please, you gotta wake up, man. I, I do eventually want to, like, play a trick on somebody. <laughs> Tony. What? You, you gotta wake up, man. Okay. Eventually, <coughs> I want to get enough money to pay, like, actors or somebody. To, Just like, do that to someone? Fuck with somebody like that yes! all day. I was thinking about that not too long ago. Just, like, I want... To do a and, prank just like that. And not even, like, just bring it up, like, bring it up, like, very, like, <clears throat> silently, almost. Like, at the end of our conversation. Just be like, hey, man, how's your day? Like, have, like, a genuine conversation with somebody. And it's like, okay, man, I'll see you later. Hey, don't forget to wake up. Like that. All fucking day. I wanted to do it to someone where it's just like, uh... Someone sees him on the street and they grab him by the shoulders. They're like, "Dude, you need to wake up." And they say, "Like Tom, you need to wake up." I'm like, oh, who the fuck are you? And like... they just walk away. And they get into work. They're like, "Dude, I had some guy just stopped me on the street and said I need to wake up." It's like, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. You need to get back to work and you need to wake up. <laughs> Tom, it's your boss. You gotta wake up, man. We all miss you here. And he'd be like, "Excuse me, you heard me. You need to get those files on my desk." Oh. <laughs> Man, that would be... That would fuck with... If someone did that to me, that would ruin me. Forever. <coughs> I wanted to do something like that. And then just chloroform them at some point. See, now you're just saying it too much. And then have them wake up in a hospital bed. And everyone's just like... Oh he finally God, woke up and everyone comes in. <laughs> and then we go out for a nice big, like, welcome back to life dinner. And then everyone leaves him at the restaurant to pay the bill. And then when the waitress is like, he walks out like, where'd all my friends go? The like, waitress will go. What friends? There was no one else here. Sir, you need to wake up. <laughs> That's fucking evil. That is, that is raw. That is fucked up. I saw a picture the other day. Yeah. And you might have seen it. It was a picture of, uh, the pixel art of Mario. Yeah. Also, did you see that fucking rib shot? That was fucking sick. That was, that was fucking sick. That was that pretty was fucking sick cool. sick unintentional. I don't even finish my sentence, because that was just too cool. Fuck this level, dude. Next time on Spongebob. We still got ten seconds, what the fuck are you talking about? Next time on Next Spongebob, time on Sponge <laughs> God. I'm gonna fucking fist fight you it's okay. with it's my like lips, the last, like, sexually. It's like the last like minute of the video that I said, oh it's okay. <laughs> Next time on Spongebob, I love you. Goodbye. Last time on Spongebob, I don't know what the fuck we were doing. Last time, I think, oh yeah, this part. I think we were, uh, uh, man. I fuck this so hard. Wow, and... <laughs> Right off the bat. Fuck this so hard. Right off the bat, we're doing this perfect. On this episode of Metroid Prime, I'm going to show you how to clip to the ground. First, you want to make sure you're in a morph ball, then you as Samus Aaron. Then as Samus Aaron, you want to make sure that you're grinding right against the corner of the ground, and then hopefully with enough chances, you can get un underneath the ground, Hello? and then you can get to the end of Metroid Prime. This, yeah. is, this has been Metro Meltdown with Metroid Prime speedrunning tactics. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. What the fuck are you doing? I uh, I was watching uh, Metro Meltdown uh, speedrun <coughs> video games. Dude, he's my favorite speedrunner. He's my favorite speedrunner. Did you know that he's very good at half pressing A? Yes, I did. He invented it. He invented half pressing A. It's his signature. So, uh, Amiibo update. 
since it's been a couple, it's been a couple Jesus. episodes. Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, yesterday, I drove up to my local Best Buy and Target. Actually, it's not too local, it's kind of on the other side of town. And, uh, I was able to pick up a, uh, Ryu and, uh, Jigglypuff Amiibo. I also got Fox too, but that's kind of not that special. I just was late to the party on that one. But yeah, I, I finally caught up on that shit. I've only got, I think, 12 left in terms of Amiibo and the Smash Brothers line because I'm not going out of my way to get anything else. Are you sure? Yeah. I will only get other Amiibo from other series if it's like there and cheap. So like Kirby? Maybe. I don't, probably not. Like unless it's at Walmart or something. Then I probably won't get it. What about that Tom Nook? Well, I already have Tom Nook, but that's because it was at my store, and it was there. More like Tom Crook, you know what I mean? Hey, Carl. Yeah, what's Where'd up? you come up with that joke at? Where'd you come up with that joke at, Carl? Uh, oh. Where'd you come up with that joke at, Carl? Uh, that's all a pretty funny joke. Thank you! <laughs> I've been working on my comedy act! I should also say Amiibo update that Carl sent me uh, Greninja and Samus. Aaron. I did, and because he's a cool guy. I have a story to tell you about when I went to go and ship that out. To tell. I went to the post office. Okay. That's a great story. I stood in line to hand the lady my package and say, please ship this out. And there was another woman who was there just off on the side filling out forms or something because she had to send out a letter or something and this guy came in and he was just like oh, I don't know like he's like the definition of a hipster he had the fucking scarf he had the glasses and he's just like standing behind me and then the lady like steps back in line and he's like uh, excuse me what are you doing She's like, I was here before you. He's like, well, you shouldn't step off of line if you're going to send something. I have important things to do. And I almost turned around and backhanded him and told him to shut the fuck up, because I was just not in the goddamn mood to deal with that. You already had to... I, I actually got really mad about that. 